Hey guys, so um, since my last video of about OSC Clements Job Corp Academy, since that's become very successful and people have um, been coming here from watching and you know interacting with me, that is great. And um, this one day in the cafeteria, I don't know if, if this person will be watching, but if you are watching, you um, you might know um, what I'm about to talk about, but. It's like during lunch, I was in line after I got my food. He handed me like you know my cup because he had you know cafeteria duty, and he asked me if I did YouTube videos, and I was like yeah, and you know, and he's like you know he liked my video. I'm like okay, and you know I'm guessing it's the one about Earl C. Clements, and I'm like did you come here because of it and because of it, and he did. So if you are watching this and the person that that said that to me in the cafeteria if you are watching this video <laughs> right now uh please do try to get in contact with me somehow uh, i'm always gonna be wearing this senior hoodie until it gets warmer and then as the warm weather comes you know i'll be wearing my light pikachu jacket but you'll see me around with that often when spring hits and the rain that we're gonna get soon stops but uh if you're watching this, I don't know your name, but uh, please come find me and hunt me down and I, we really need to uh, do a video together. But anyway, moving on to that, I'm going to talk more in depth about Earl C. Clements because I don't know exactly what I covered in my previous video, so this is a part two. So starting on with traits, and I've written everything down this time, um, we have culinary. UAW, which is mechanics, we have auto body, uh, um, we, I don't know much about it, but, you know, if you're doing mechanics, you can do the basic mechanics, you can do the advanced, you know, there's just so many different things of, you know, mechanics that you can do, so we have that here as well, we have CDL, and now for that you have to, uh, have your license for at least like a year, your driver's license. Deckhand, males only, only males. Electrical, welding, tile settings, you know, replacing down tiles and bathrooms and living room and all that stuff. Um, computer technician, um, office administration, CNA, and medical administration assistant. It's like, you know, if you're in a doctor's office and you know, you're behind that desk or whatever, you know, taking phone calls and stuff, that's basically what this is, that is. And I, I do believe we have materials and handling, but I'm not sure about forklift, forklift, the forklifting, excuse me, I tongue twister a little bit, so, but I'm not sure if we have that, so I do, um, want, recommend you look into that if you are interested, if they have it here, I'm not sure, I have to ask around. Um, we do get paid $25 every two weeks, specifically on a Tuesday. Um, you have to be out of your dorm by 7 a.m. And if not, you know, you might get in trouble. I'm not sure. But I always leave by at least 6.20 in the morning to head to breakfast. Um, you have to be at class by 7.45 a.m. If you take medicine, I do recommend you at least get up by 6, 6.15, go to breakfast, and then go immediately straight to um, wellness, which is our medical center on campus. Go take your meds if you have morning meds or whatever and then go to class that's what i do every morning so um and class lets out at 3 15 p.m and we do have one hour lunch it depends on you know what class you're in and um, we also do have a uh, high school here we do penn foster and um victory tech so if you do not have your uh ged or high school diploma i do recommend that you do come here and get that you know we, we do either one of those two but you're still gonna get you know your diploma either way um we do get three course meals and it's all free which is breakfast lunch and dinner if you just go to the cafeteria we go in line as many times as we want you know some people like to sit down their plate you know at the table and go back in line and get seconds and then they'll be like their, their meal you know or they prefer to eat first and then go back in line you know just go in line as many times as you want. It's free. You ain't gonna pay nothing for it. You know, dorms, which is housing. 
that's free. Um, we do have a convenience store, which is at the Student Union here, which is a small snack shack. You know, we have, we sell things here for like snacks. Well, not really snacks, well, like, you know, french fries, corn dogs, burgers, you know, that kind of thing. Pizza, you know, that, that kind of little, uh, I guess, snack shack, you know. But it, it is very cheap. It is cheap. I, I promise you it is cheap. It's, it's pretty good amazing and the convenience store is also cheap too cheaper than an actual you know walmart honestly um they do give out free detergent like you know little tie pod things they do give those out to you if you need to do your laundry and of course laundry is free and gotta pay for that you know um after roll call on every night on weekdays it's 9 15 except for wednesday wednesdays at 8 15 and weekends is at 11 o'clock except for Sunday so and you do get a snack every night and a drink so that's good and you do get to sign up for trips so all you have to do is like every Monday after class you go to the um, RA I don't know the actual word for it but you go to the staff um, in the dorm and ask to see if you can sign up you just put your name and then your school ID and then you know you if you, your name it makes it on the list, then you go. And they do also take you to Walmart the same week you do get paid. So if you go to the 400 dorm, you go on a Wednesday. Same with 300 dorm, you go on a Wednesday as well. And also, um, I think the 500 dorm, which is independent living, which you have, you have to be more an advanced student, you know. I'll, have to, I'll explain more on that later on. Um, in the next video because it's so important to talk about but you know that's more the advanced students where they go and they stay but they go on a Wednesday or Tuesday um, and if you're in the 900 dorms you go on a Thursday so there's that and uh, about the luggage uh, it is uh, 50 pounds per luggage like an actual like luggage um, I will not bring anything inappropriate at all no drugs, no nothing. You can't have none of that. You can have cigarettes, but it cannot be black and mild. Mostly people smoke here is Newport. I do not smoke. So, yeah, and no, uh, no tobacco or anything in, is allowed here. So, yeah. So, um, if you have any questions or anything about um, RLC comments, please do comment down below and I will, um, you know, respond as much as I can if I can I'm probably busy doing classwork and other things going on in life right now so and uh, also if you do come here which I'm hoping you will because this you know place is really amazing and it is a good place to come to to get your education to start a career and everything else so if you see me I will be wearing this quite often and you know when you come here between the next couple months during the summer you'll mostly see me wear a Pikachu jacket or any kind of you know cosplay outfit you know some people like to call me um because I just wore my cosplay outfit that I got for my birthday you know a couple days ago and everyone was calling me little red riding hood and I'm like ah no <laughs> but you know I'm the one that wears the weird outfits and the Pikachu stuff and into animator thing so what can I say that's just me so if you see me anywhere on campus just say hey I know you you know just come talk to me I'm I'm totally open with any conversations but if I shy off a little bit I probably don't know you to explain yourself because a lot of people try to talk to me in class and I just get like really you know socially awkward because I'm like um hi you know like they ask you know like hey do I have gum or whatever I'm like no you know, and there's like moments, like days where I just want to be alone and just focus on my work. So, uh, yeah. But go ahead and uh, hit me up um, on campus if you come here and you see me around. I'm more than welcome to be happy to talk to you on anything. So, but if you like this video, please um, give it a thumbs up. And if you don't, you can thumbs it down if you like. Um... Also, share this video um, with all your friends and family and on any social media that is interested in Job Corps. 
and if you want you can also click the bell icon down below um, for further notifications on future videos so hope you guys have a good day bye